Hey guys, it's Spartancraft for the win here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to install Pixelmon for Minecraft 1.6.2. Now this mod is fairly simple to install, and lots of people have been uploading Pixelmon series on YouTube. I'll be doing the same pretty soon, so check out my series once it is up. So let's get started with installing the mod. First, you're going to need to get to your .minecraft folder. To, to do that, you're just going to need to type percent app data percent in your start menu, and then hit enter and then it'll bring you to your role room folder. Then you'll see this file called .minecraft. In this folder, it basically contains all of your Minecraft files, such as your world and uh, all your other mods that you may have installed before. Uh, so we're gonna need to delete this. So um, you might wanna back up your worlds before deleting this file because you probably want them for later on. I've already done that before recording, so I'm just gonna go ahead and delete it. There we go. And now we can minimize this window here, and we can go into Minecraft. Now it's going to ask us to log in with our username and password, so I'm just going to do so. Once you're done logging in, you'll be at this normal page here. It's going to want to click play. And that's just basically going to download Minecraft 1.6.2, a nice fresh file. And then you'll just be at the normal Minecraft main menu. We now just exit out of Minecraft. And now we're going to need to go and download all of the mods that we're going to need to install. So all the um, links for the downloads will be in the description like always. Um, so first off, we're just going to download Pixelmon. Um, so once you're at the Pixelmon uh, website, you're just going to need to scroll down past all the changes, change log here. And then you'll see downloads. And you'll see Pixelmon 2.3 install or Pixelmon then whatever your version is. I'm on uh, the latest version of Pixelmon is 2.3. So I'm just going to download Pixelmon 2.3. Then you'll see two links. You'll see link 1 and link 2. It does not matter which one you choose. I'm just going to choose link 1. And then it's going to take you to an ad fly page. You're going to need to wait 5 seconds. Then click skip ad. Then it'll take you to this media fire page. Then you're just going to want to click the green download button right here. Once you've done that, we're now going to need to download Minecraft Forge. You're going to want to go down to the recommended 1.6.2 or recommended, then your version. I'm on 1.6.2, so I'd choose the recommended 1.6.2. And then you're going to want to download the installer. Make sure you download the installer. Do not download Universal, SRC, or Changelog. You need to download the installer. I've already downloaded that too, so uh, I don't need to worry about that. And then, um, you're just going to want to move uh, both your files to the desktop. It just makes it easier to access them. And then we're going to take the Minecraft Forge file and we're going to need to open it. Now, we're going to need to... Well, by default, it may be... Um, by default, it might open in an extracted program like WinRAR or 7-Zip. But we're going to need to... We um, don't want to open it with that. So, to bypass that, we're just going to want to right-click, open with java platform se binary make sure you open it with that um or else it won't work so we're just gonna open that give it a second to open and there we go this little program will come up and then we're gonna need to uh, make sure install client is selected it should be selected by default um then click ok and instantly it should say successfully installed and just click ok and then we are done with that now we're just gonna need to launch minecraft one more time and then where it says profile and then it should say your username here you're gonna want to go down to forge and then click play here and then we're gonna click play and then it's just gonna download a few things shouldn't take too long and then once everything is done downloading you should be at the normal minecraft menu here but then you should see down here minecraft forge is installed and now we can just exit out of minecraft again and then we're gonna need to go back into our percent app or our, our roaming uh folder here and you'll see dot minecraft is back here and then you'll see all these files here once you open it 
then it's gonna need to get an extracting program such, such as WinRAR 7-Zip. I'm using a program called BandyZip. Um, it's just like WinRAR. I'll leave a link to download it in the description. Then we're just gonna open it. And then you'll see these two files. You're gonna want to select them both. And then you're gonna want to put that to the side here. Like that. And go into here. And then have them all selected. And then just drag them into the .minecraft folder. Do not put them into any folder here. And then just click yes. And there we go. Make sure you put them in the .minecraft. Remember that. Now we can just exit out of both these, and now we can run Minecraft. Make sure the profile is Forge, and then click play. And now we are at the normal Minecraft menu, like always. And if you go to mods, Right here, you should see Pixelmon. And then we're just gonna go and to show you that I'm just gonna create a new world. I'll save all that default. And as you see here, it did work because it's asking me to pick a starter Pokemon. Let's go Charmander. I'm kind of lagging because I'm recording my screen. Um, but yeah, you can see a few Pokemon over here. I'm just going to turn down some of my settings. There we go. A lot better. As you can see here, we have Pokemon. If I hit R here, Charmander. there's Charmander. Charmander! It's kind of annoying. Just... There we go. Let's see if you Pokemon here. So it did work. Um, so yeah, hopefully you guys, this did work for you guys. Um, we have, what is this, a Pokemon Center. Yeah, so like I said, hope this worked for you guys. Uh, if you have any problems, uh, just leave your problem in the comments, and I should, I'll help you solve it. And yeah, I'll also like I said before, I'll be doing a um, series, a Pixelmon series. And uh, yeah, so I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Please leave a like if you did, and subscribe if you are new. And I'll see you guys later.